this look, I'm going to be using my semi-sweet chocolate bar from Too Faced. So if you're interested in this look, keep on watching. I'm going to go ahead and apply my Urban Decay Eyeshadow Primer in Eden. And I'm going to apply this all over my eyes. Now I'm going to get Max Paint Pot in Painterly. I'm going to use this as my base and I'm going to apply it all over my lid. Now with a fluffy blending brush like this one, I'm going to go ahead and grab peanut butter. And I'm going to apply this as my transition color above my crease, just going back and forth, slowly building up the color. And whatever is left on my brush, I'm just going to go in circular motions. Now I'm going to grab the same color and apply it on the inner part of my eye, making sure to blend that out. You don't want any blank spots. And I'm also going to apply this on the outer part of my eye. With the same fluffy brush, I'm going to go ahead and grab mousse. And I'm going to apply this on my crease, just going back and forth and whatever is left of my brush in circular motions. I'm sorry, I tend to lean forward a lot, especially when I get into it, so something I need to work on. Sorry. Now with a flat eyeshadow brush like this one, I'm going to go ahead and grab licorice. And I'm going to apply this all over my lid. I'm just going to go ahead and pack it all on. And again, I'm leaning forward, I'm sorry. I'm going to go ahead and grab a little bit more and just pack it on. And slowly start building the shape of my eyelid. With a fluffy brush that has nothing on, I'm just going to go ahead and blend that out as much as I possibly can. And with the same fluffy brush, I'm going to grab just a little tiny bit of black. And I'm just going to go ahead and blend that out. Just so there will be a nice transition. With the same fluffy brush, I'm going to go ahead and grab truffled. I'm going to apply it on the crease so there to be a nice transition between the peanut butter color and the black. And you don't want any black spots. So just blend, blend, and blend until your eyes hurt. Now with a pointy eyeshadow brush like this one, I'm going to go ahead and grab Butter Pecan. But I'm first going to apply some MAC Fix Plus on my brush and then grab the color and apply it on the tear duct. Now I'm going to go ahead and get a Q-tip with some makeup remover and I'm just going to go ahead and clean that up. It's going to give me a nice neat look and it's also going to make it look even more dramatic. Now with a small eyeshadow brush I'm going to go ahead and apply licorice on my lower lashes. And with an eyeshadow brush like this one, I'm going to go ahead and grab just a little bit of that peanut butter color just to smoke it out. And this is the final look. This is the final look. I hope you guys liked this tutorial. If you did, make sure you hit that like button, subscribe. Drop a beautiful comment and if you recreate this look, make sure to get a picture and tag me on Instagram using hashtag Ashley Marlin. Now, this look is kind of me coming out of my comfort zone, playing with black, facing my fears. Remember when I used to film my videos in my living room and I was saying how, face your fears, play with black, la la la. This is me doing it. I hope you guys have been doing it as well. So, I challenge you to play with black, do a smoky eye because when you play with black and you do a smoky eye and stuff like this, you learn from your mistakes, okay? You learn that, oh no, I shouldn't place it there anymore. So, like, you learn from it. So, if you don't practice, you're not gonna get anywhere. So, practice, 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 okay? So, um, yeah. I contoured with the Anastasia Beverly Hills Contour Kit. I highlighted it with my Revlon Color Stay Mineralized Finishing Powder. I don't even know if they make this anymore. This is like super old, but I love it. I've had it for so many years, I know, but I'm a makeup hoarder. What can I say? And on my lips, I lined my lips with the Giordana Lip Liner in Natural. Then I went over it with my MAC Lipstick and Velvet Teddy. Then I went over it with a NYX Lip Gloss in Smoky Look, and that's basically it. Oh, and my eyelashes. They're from House of Lashes and Iconic, and 
yeah that that completes the look basically any requests or anything like that leave them down below and i'll see you guys next time